I decided that instead of going through Albania, I would go back to Skopje and into Kosovo and then try to go to Montenegro from there. So you're probably wondering what the heck is she doing in Tirana, Albania? Yeah, that's a, not quite a long story, but it's a funny one. When I left my hostel this morning, I left under the assumption that I would get on a bus back to Skopje, from there go to Kosovo, and so on. But on the way there, well, I was walking to the station with two guys who were coming to Tirana. We were going to the same bus station in Ohrid, uh And we were talking about why I'm not going through Albania. Basically, uh, I didn't want hassle traveling alone in Albania. And one thing led to another, they sort of uh, suggested that I just tag along with them. And I did, because it'll be quicker for me to get from here to Montenegro than having to go back to Skopje, to Kosovo, and so on and so forth. So I am in Albania. We uh, went to the bus station and in the end negotiated for a uh, car for the three of us, a uh, taxi. And we paid just a little bit more each than the bus would have been. And it was quicker um, and it was fine. We were here very quick. And it is so hot here. It was 80 degrees when we came pouring sweat so here i am it's now 7 20 and i'm just going to go downstairs work on some editing and relax because i need i'm tired i'm exhausted it is monday june 22nd 23rd and we're doing a walking tour a free walking tour of tirana it is really hot in the sun um but it's okay in the shade and i care about the city either <laughs> of the Berlin Wall, that is a bunker. That was a good city tour. Um, I'm not impressed with the city. Um, it's, it's not pretty, uh, but it is vibrant and busy. And it was good to see it. I'm only here, today's my only full day here. Uh, so it was good. Now it is 2.30 and it is unbearably hot out. So I'm just going to sit downstairs in the shade and do some processing. 